Hello and welcome in to an episode of Farm Sim 22 on Old Family Farm. A map I've been working on for months now. I mean months. Quite a while. I mean I've got a couple of videos out in my uh, on my channel that if you look them up you'll see I ain't kidding it's been a while. Um, anyway let's get started. Welcome partner. Grandpa left you this farm. It needs a lot of work to get it in shape. Do you have what it takes to do that? Well, let's just find out how good you really are. Well, all right. So, chicken coops here. Obviously, the house is there. Seed and fertilizer. Well, let's go ahead and get this guy off while we still look around. Alright. And we might as well start this guy over here. New Holland TX32. Alright, let's get it opened up and get it going. And it's leaving a swath. Okay. Yeah, I hope this does alright. I don't know. I mean. Okay, so we got cedar, we got a fertilizer, we got another tractor here. Yeah, I think we've got pretty much what we need to start. Some storage over here. Now back in 15, or actually 13, when this map was out, this is where the, uh, actually no, in 13 it didn't have anything here, if I'm not mistaken. It wasn't until 15 that they added the wood chips. Well, this is where they put the wood chips at in 15. I don't remember. In 13 what was there, if anything. I also remember back in 13, this actually had a uh, usage, and so did this other one, and so did this one actually. This is where the sugar beets and the potatoes went. Of course, in 15 as well. Now you got the tip anywhere, you know, you don't have to worry about it. Water tire, that's a good thing to have. Uh, the fuel's missing. I could have swore I'd put that in here, but I guess not. Personally, I think put something there to block off that door and use it for storage. But here's your cow pasture. Now, I remember back in... 13 and 15 and 19, it was, you know, manure pile was right here. This whole field, I mean, the whole thing was your cow pasture. But since they've made it this way, it's different. And all of this used to be part of the pasture as well, right up to the, uh, right about here. Yeah, right in here somewhere. And it went all the way back that way. This field here wasn't even here. And this water 
over here. This used to be okay. Um, I'll have to look into that. I didn't realize that, that was not a regular. But I bet we can't get water from that, can we? Anyway. Also, when, uh, when looking at the map to try and buy some land, well, you'd go to buy field 12 and it'd be cut off. Now, I have fixed that. I have actually changed where field 15 is, well, the 15 mark. Um... There. So, value is not bad. None of the values are bad, really. This is actually field one, or farmland one. And you got eight and then 13. The reason why the one shows up here is because of this corner right here, or this area right here, to this area right here, is like a straight line. The way the game sees it, that's part of that line, so it puts it right what it thinks is center. When technically the one should be like over here, but we don't get the we don't get the chance of putting it in there. It generates it automatically all right well go back over here now i put these trees in right here these these trees i think that one was already there but i put in all these ones just made this area look better more filled out now if we ever want to put something over here then we can cut these down and add something to it but again i remember when these used to be actually working silos one was i think grass and one was chaff or something like that these all right, so technically this is not my map. I did not make this map. I'm just re-editing it my likings, the way I like the map. And a lot of the inspiration of the map is from 13 slash 15. Farm some 13, you know, farm some uh, 15. Anyway, which had this type of silo. Granted, it had a... Uh, like a square box right here that you dumped into. This is my doings. Which, uh, interesting. But, uh, yeah, I took this out of another map and added a few things and, you know, changed the colors. And made it look this way. And because unlike uh, 13 and 15 where you could put it to where 13 it was, this one was corn, this one was uh, canola, or actually not even canola, it was corn, uh, wheat, barley, and uh, yeah, it was canola, wasn't it? Anyway, there was only the four types of crops and they went in there sugar beads potatoes which well wood chips weren't even around 13 unless you had the mod 15 is when they added the wood chips and all that anyway this is one where you dump out you dump in and dump out working Bunker silo. 
got a plow there. It's kind of a tiny plow, but it's a plow. All right, that's working good. This is working good. All right. I'm gonna grab this other tractor. And go take a drive. Boy, are they loud in there. Anyway. That's the farm animal market. Put it that way. Uh, it's animal market. Not farm market. Uh, good one. I don't know these roads because they were not in the original map. These were added by somebody else. I do not know who. Um, in all honesty, I don't even know if the creator of this map is even around still. I just know I've edited it to work the way I want it to work. That'll lead you back up to the farm. Well, just behind the farm. Good areas to log, if you want to log. There's even a farm over here. If I'm not mistaken, I think they had the pig farm over here somewhere. On the hill over there. And I chose to take and move it to where it originally used to be. And there's some greenhouses out here if you want to get them working. Which we just may. These are in much better shape than they were. That's an area where you can make a field. Looks like they have fields on the map. Be here, but they're not actually plotted in. Yeah, so they've got it marked as if there's fields here. But they're not actually plotted in. So, needless to say, they won't do anything. They don't have a number and they're not assigned. That being the case, they're just grass fields. That's all they are. Well, for the most part, and then some have trees in them.
Okay, we're coming up on this little uh, mom and pop store. That's the way we came in from. That's the way we went. Now we're going this way. We have a little mom and pop store for fuel. It actually does have the fuel trigger as you see up there in the top left corner. And there's a buy point right or a sub point right here. I did not know that that didn't have collisions. Nice to know. Huh. Did not know that. Yeah, this opens and closes. I don't remember what that's named. That is named. Uh, buy station, maybe? I have no idea. No, that's not it. Gotta be Bay Grains. Let's tag it. Yep, Bay Grains. So. actually got a name to it this uh, map doesn't have very many cell points so I added that one now if we follow this around it's going to take us back behind what was normally called farm number three um, Matter of fact, back in 13, and I believe even in 15, it had teleport uh, dots that you could go up to, and it would say farm 1, farm 2, farm 3. Well, this was farm 3. Farm 1 was where we started at. Farm 2 is where the pigs are. And we'll be getting to that here in a little bit. And I got a feeling I was just told that Combines either full or getting there. Whoa! Nice area for uh, mowing. This is uh, bringing you just around the outskirt of the farm. Farm number three, that is. Has that got a collision? I don't remember. It must. I came to a stop and didn't move. Yeah, that's got a collision. Good to know because it's right there technically in the road. And this is all original. I did not mess with this as far as this stuff goes right here. I did, however, change the uh, animal pen. I got a Nope, that is got a collision. Yeah, I put this one in here. If I'm not mistaken. I could almost swear. It used to be fenced off in here. And that over there was actually the sheep trimming area. I don't know what you call it when you take the shearing. The sheep shearing station. I can only assume that's what it was called. I don't know for a fact. Don't hold me to that. I could have swore there used to be a road that went over on the back side of this. But I could be wrong there. Yeah. Could almost swear it went like right here. Well, you know what? That's alright. Never really liked that road in the first place. If memory is serving me correctly. 
Anyway, let's go ahead and go on over to the next area. And we'll go through this way instead of going through the backside. It has always been a bit laggy right through here. I never could understand why. I'm going to drive around here real quick because I want to see something. Yep, the road has been not there. Why? What? Well, uh, it's been so many years that they don't use this road no more. Well, the road goes right there. It connects us up. Oh, well. Guess not no more. And now that sign is completely unlegible. Huh. I mean, there is going to be some differences. Like, uh, this shouldn't be grass. Huh. Anyway. And up to the field shouldn't be grass either. Should be an opening right here. But yeah, you got a field here. And out back of this building right here in this corner was where the uh, teleporter tabs were and there was also I think a camper right here yeah it was like really old school and worn down Alright, over here is where the pigs are. <clears throat> you got some storage over here. You got your pig pen. And over here, you got your uh, manure. Oh, there's a wall there. I cut too soon. Um, okay. just drive back around and go back to the main farm and grab the trailer go dump the uh, combine cause I'm pretty sure that's what I heard go beep <coughs> pardon me while I clear my throat I think it's the water in this map that's always been laggy I'm not positive Just saw no.
I don't know why there's not the wood chip pile in here. I didn't put this on the map, so I don't know. Kind of would make sense to put the wood chips in there. The old church. And yes, I added a bridge. It's a town that should have a bridge. And here's your store. I also added in the uh, cell point because whoever made the map or brought back the map out, you know, brought it back out, didn't bother to put it in. That or didn't know how. Either way, I put it back in. Yeah. You got your cell point there. All sorts of stuff over here. I uh, believe the wool cell point. Not sure where the wool cell point is. I don't remember. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's see. Let's see if we can figure this out together. Cotton goes to Bay Grains. Uh, hay, hay Barn, Seed and Feed. South Elm Creek. Rail, railroad? Uh, eggs go to pretty much the same places. Wool. All the same places. Shoe. Not hard to figure out. Anyway. Yep, yeah, combines wool. I just seen it. And for those who are wondering, when I turn, I can only turn to there. Can't go any further. I cannot turn all the way around. And when you look at the camera, offset when I turn too. It's as if you're actually turning your head to look out the window. One of the mods I love. It's a cab view mod. And that's cultivated. Did that need to be plowed? Because if it did, I just cultivated it for no reason. Okay. Y'all are probably wondering. Yes, I am getting buttons confused because I have them bouncing between Farm Sim 15 and Farm Sim 17, 19, no, you know, actually not 19, 15, 17, and 22. Um, I do have 19 as well, but just haven't done anything on that. I've been working on this map for a while and I wanted to basically show y'all what I've gotten done and play on it for a bit. Not mistaken, yes, yeah, so that white fence right there that goes around the backside and over there as well. That actually was me. I put that in there. Because it didn't go there. 
<laughs> I did that just because I like the way it looks. And it brings in the uh, farm a bit. I put the trees in, kind of give us some life, make it look a little decent. There we go. And that one over there works as well. That, I'll tell you, I had, I had the most trouble getting these all put in. Because what I did, put the fence in, I actually put it in, in game. Like we are right now. And then, exited the game, saved it, and exited, went into the files, found the uh, XML that had the fence in it, took the information from that and put it into the i3d so it would actually be here permanently but i don't have to worry about this i don't have to go in and put it in every time i start the game it's already there permanent thing it stays in it all these things are um including this little seed and fertilizer hut i actually took this out of the game put these in myself because they were in there originally in the older versions but in this one it wasn't it was empty and it had a jeep parked in here so I took this out made it a, made it into a mod where it could be placed anywhere and put these in here and then I put it in here and made it towards a permanent fixture actually have a feeling I'm gonna have to set off the plow in this field because I didn't bother to look actually I don't want to put the cultivator in there because, well, I want to put the combine in it. I don't know how wide this thing is, so I don't know how far over I need to be. All I can tell you is this thing's like very small. But I'm pretty sure. I'm having to do uh, field five, wasn't it? That's three, that's uh, what? No, it's field seven. My bad. I'm over too far. All right, so, yeah, I guess field two is the grass field, field three, okay. All right, well, yep, needs plowing. And there's a small section over there that didn't get uh, cultivated. Probably due to that tree.
And yep, it's stopping right before the end of the field. We'll make just a couple of rows real quick and then uh, send him on his way the other direction. Anyway, how's that one doing? It looks like he is done over there, so that's good. Um, yeah. You know what? I don't know why I'm doing that. Might as well just do this. What the world? What are you doing? What are you doing? Why didn't you just back? What the hell is he doing? I'm not quite sure what I was just looking at or why. Get this one put away now. Your yeah, thing is not really focusing right. I think that's got enough uh, turning area now. gone over our time so hopefully you've enjoyed what you've seen of this map so far and I look forward to hearing all your opinions as to how you think it looks if you like it don't like it uh, if you think something can be added or taken away you know any of that stuff let me know what you think in the comments I really would like to hear your opinion on how I've got everything set up that I've done myself. Not everything that everybody else has done now. This is somebody else's map. I'm only editing it to look more like the original. 
from FS 13 slash 15. So, uh, but anyway, hopefully y'all enjoyed what you've seen. And if so, please hit that like button. It does help the channel to be uh, seen by other people. And it helps us to grow as well. Also, if you're new here and you want to see more and you like it, like the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the uh, bell icon so you get notified of any videos that get posted or live streams that I may do. Meantime, though, y'all take care, y'all stay safe, and I will catch y'all in the next one. Bye!